Hello, my name is David Thompson and I'm the founder and principal of Assemblage and welcome to the Laurel Hills residence. The driving concept behind this home was to blur the lines between indoor and outdoor. This single story home is composed of three pavilions connected by a series of glass hallways featuring simple and unaffected materials such as western red cedar, charcoal painted cement board, and a lot of glass. As in all our residential projects, we look beyond the confines of the house to the perimeter of the site in order to pull the living experience outward. As you enter the property, the entry sequence sets the mood as visitors pass through a tranquil courtyard with three 85-year-old olive trees. The entry door is set within a glass hallway that connects the living pavilion to the west and the sleeping pavilion to the east. This threshold establishes a sense of intimate scale before engaging with the other parts of the house. Well, the living room really exemplifies the ethos of the house. The connectivity to the outdoors is evident as the living and dining room can fully be opened on both sides to create a connection between the courtyard and the rear yard. When the living room is completely open, the various seating arrangements and outdoor rooms allow for seamless connectivity between the spaces. The furniture pieces are in complete harmony with the ecosystem of the architecture. I'm a huge fan of Charles and Ray Eames and their work, and I've always wanted one of their lounge chairs. And this is an extra special design piece that has been in my mind since the home's inception. On the western edge of the living pavilion, you will find the kitchen, breakfast room, and family room. And this is one of the spaces that my family, we spend most of our time. Maintaining a minimalistic look, the kitchen end of the living pavilion was designed with custom charcoal painted cabinetry to complement the Calcutta crema marble surfaces that is beautifully featured in the oversized kitchen island that contains the range top, a concealed hood, and ample bar top seating for three to four. Continuing on into the master bedroom culminates the experience by creating a private and secluded oasis that is truly one with its surroundings. Waking up in the master is like waking up from a beautiful dream. The built-in seating and custom designed bed provide a peaceful respite from the rest of the house. The abundance of glass and the sliding glass windows allow the master bedroom to connect with the landscape. And to complement the master bedroom, the master bathroom evokes a spa-like experience. The skylight in the shower floods the entire bathroom with light, which is highlighted along the undulating surface of the wall tile. The marble tub surround and thick marble countertops create a tranquil retreat. Now the outside is something you have to experience. The 40 foot long pool and ample yard space create a series of outdoor rooms for outdoor entertaining that seamlessly interact with all of the public spaces of the interior of the house. Included in our landscape proposal, my wife was adamant about having a vegetable garden. We have a small raised corten planter that has tomatoes, cucumbers, and zucchinis. And with an extensive backyard like this, why not? Thanks for joining me today. That concludes our tour of the Laurel Hills residence. I enjoyed spending time with you and I hope to see you here again soon. Thanks for watching. Like what you see on the show? Well, be sure to subscribe to our channel. We have so many more beautiful homes to share. How about love? Share these homes, you know?